Hi friends, myself Amma Sharif, Education Mentor Student Life Coach and Career Coach. And this video is brought to you by It's My Masters Redefined Careers. And today's video, we would like to discuss working experience with It's My Masters. And this is Suresh. Hi. Hi. Suresh, have a small intro about yourself. My name is uh, Suresh. Yeah. I have finished my graduation in Usman University in uh, B.Sc. Biotechnology and Botany Chemistry. Okay. And secured with eighty-eight uh, percentage. Yeah. So our journey, I think, it has been started one and a half year back, right? Yes. So. Your was a special case with credits. Yes. Like you had only one sixty four credits, and that too in three years bachelor's degree. So, what was the difficulty of uh, getting an admission with the less credits? Having one sixty four credits, uh, it uh, remains a uh, very challengeable. If we want to get uh, a good university, uh, we must uh, should have one eighty credits. Yeah. Choosing a better course and choosing better college, we must have one uh, eighty credits. Yeah, but with the challenges, like what we felt for one and a half year. Like finally we got an admit. Yes. So what do you feel like the journey of this turmoil? Like for one and a half year, it was like you don't know whether you would get an admit or not. What were you feeling about it? So uh, finally we applied uh, to two to three universities. Yeah. But we got uh, only one admit. Yeah. So I never expected that uh, I will get admit in that particular university. So before finally, applying for the two to three, because we have filtered with almost thirty yeah. eight in biotechnology. and uh, environmental and natural sciences also some 40 78 courses we applied first before applying application we applied we for we, we we mailed them and we got the approval whether it is applicable or not like uh, whether you will get an admit or not but beyond that calculations beyond the course coordinates reply you got an admit from a different expectation yes sir. so how do you feel about it we have mail a uh, few other universities yeah. even though but uh, they replied that uh, we must need uh, 180 credits and uh, ielts work experience yeah but finally uh, only we got uh, four approvals from uh, yeah among four, all the universities you we got four approvals only four approvals so we applied to that uh, particular university yeah even though they gave approval due to uh, credits uh, they rejected our application yeah it was like a different yeah. like who said yes again yes. it got re- rejected. rejected and your percent as you said earlier is 88%, 88% so this is not just with the percentage yeah. and just with the credits it has an all round experience like we can't define what is the best and wrong yeah. so what do you feel like working with consultants or like the mentor because we say ourselves as an educational mentor yeah. like what do you feel is there any difference because you have met many people right yeah. so what do you feel major difference between working with educational mentor and consultant when i go to any consultancy uh, they always look for money and they don't want to guide the students uh, in a right path yeah. so whenever uh, i try to talk with the consultants they they say they like uh, we can get uh, an uh, easy free education admit for you yeah. they don't uh, explain uh, that uh, you must require uh, credits ielts work experience yeah. everything so i have seen many uh, people students who are uh, applying for german universities yeah. and uh, in facebook group also yeah. students uh, with the 70 percentage and uh, 180 credits and the ielts uh, six months also they got admission yeah. in a uh, 2020 yeah. same college same student on um, next 2021 year yeah. they might got not get yeah not get because of the competition competition yeah. so it depends on a uh, students uh, the competition yeah more uh, the o- what o- overall competition every year the statistics changes actually yes it's not that the same past year if you get in a college yeah. that doesn't mean every year you get in that the college the same person and the same experience because in 2010 it was just 3000 students migrating from india but now it's more than 30000 so it is 10 times it's an exponential growth yes. so overall experience like what do you feel the difference between education mentor and consultant like if you can explain it would be helpful for our clients guiding uh, a students in a right path actually uh, when consultants is work they always uh, try to get money from us for uh, my personal experience they said they will charge uh, 3 lakhs per to get uh, admit uh, in a uh, free education in germany but uh, when i met uh, uh, sharif sir we almost discussed about uh, uh, courses and colleges the requirements and uh, sharif uh, sir uh, almost helped uh, me to get a short listing of universities and uh, he guided me th- uh, all through the process okay. finally you got an admit yes, and you are landing in germany now yes sir. hopefully your dream should become successful yes, and wishing you all the best for your future endeavors it's a pleasure working with you suresh thank, thank you, you.